Hey everybody, Kathy here with Paint Pouring by Kathy Miller. Welcome back to our channel. We're so happy that you could join us today. I've already got kind of black hands from my black canvas. And uh, we're gonna do a little fun here, having a 16 inch round radio bloom. I have my black tricorn black down from Sherwin-Williams. No silicone, no water, no glue. You know, it's just plain old paint right on this handy dandy color to go little container and i know they are out of it in a lot of places but i have a lot of the paint that's how that's why i can use it because i have tons of it well you stocked up i stocked up because the guy told me here in arizona that they were going to be out of stock because of what happened in texas with the uh flooding so okay Gotta get the hair out of my mouth. My central bloom colors today are going to be iridescent green yellow, which you can't see it's hidden in the background here. This is African Jade by Primary Elements. This is Fairy Wings Primary Elements. This is Emerald Green by Amsterdam. Jasmine Primary Elements. Quinacridone Violet by Golden. Pineapple Crush Primary Elements. Orange Red by Arteza. Coming back around, we have, oh, this is Heart Throb, and these are the Prism Pores okay. by Color Arch. This is Chrysocolla. This is Hot Orchid. This is Egyptian Coin. This one is Pretty Petunia. This one's Envy. And this one is Waterfalls. Okay. So we're going to start out with our central color for our bloom, which is African Jade. Primary Elements by Color Art. She's gonna be real pretty, people. Oh, and I'm using my Black Cell Activator, which is Oxide Black by Amsterdam and Australian Floetrol. Okay. So you're you're putting all these colors uh, in, in the central bloom that are on that are in the cups. Is that correct? Is that do I have that right? Uh, they are going on top of the prism pores. Oh, I see. Okay, well, <laughs> I'll just wait and see what you do here. So what is everybody up to today? We're gonna be uh, pretty hot here in Arizona, but that's okay. And I wanna let everybody know that our mama bird if you haven't heard, laid another egg, and uh, they're back sitting on them. So now the other two are out of luck, the babies from before, because the mom and the dad are sitting now, and Phil and I have only seen one egg this time. Now there might be one hidden in the background, but <clears throat> we only can see one. They don't take a lot of time between their broods, I'll tell you, because I think they said they could have four or five in a year. In a, uh, in a year, okay. Well, so, in a breeding thing, because they season? don't breed yeah, all. Yeah, right, okay. Yeah, which right. I can't believe So I either. think they only had like a couple weeks off and now they got another egg. Well, what else do they have to do when you think about it? <laughs> well, all they do is eat and you well, know what, so. Okay. <laughs> I mean, you know, if that's all you have to do. Oh, brother, who's sending me messages now? Pretty colors. That was Envy. The first one was Waterfall. This one is Pretty Petunia. Yeah, Kathy is using these uh, prism pores, and uh, they are ultra metallics. They're from Color Art. They're pre made. You can add water to them if you need to, and some other things can be added, but there are instructions on the back of each bottle. Uh, these prism pores are from Color Art, as I mentioned, and we are affiliate. You can get a 20% discount on all your purchases from Color Art by using the discount code and link in our description box. We're also an affiliate of KS Resin and Boom Gel Stains and Australian Floetrol. So there are savings links also to those products in the description box. So what Kathy is doing here is what we call the 
radial bloom and that's where you have a central bloom and then around around it you put uh, other colors of your choosing what is this now i really got a mess going on oh, me. okay oh, that's well, okay not the first time and it won't be the last time <laughs> no it won't okay now we're going to do our other colors. Okay. Get the hair would stay out of my mouth. Okay. All these colors that Kathy has in the cups have the same recipe, and that's in video 478, which is her secret recipe video, and it talks about her pouring medium, her cell activator, how she does some of her colored bases, and among other tips. Again, there's a direct link to that recipe video in the description box. So head on over. And look at it, people. There's a lot to learn in that description box, I'll tell you. A lot of good tips. Yeah, there's some extra videos. There's a video on how uh, Kathy sets up her spinner and pool setup. There's a link to that. There's also a link to some of her popular, most popular videos in there. And there's a tips and techniques uh, video link uh, in the description box, along with all the colors that Kathy uses in each painting are listed Darn in it. that description box. Oh. Jeez. Okay, where am I going here? I don't know. Um, I see. Good. I've only got a couple more to do. I'm gonna put a little pink on this blue, and I'm going to put. I'm gonna put this light. No. Yeah. Yeah, that might look not nice. The light blue on the dark blue. Okay. Yeah. Now I'm gonna top it off with my Egyptian coin. Egyptian coin is also a prison pour. Correct. Even though it's not in one of the bottles, Kathy does uh, sometimes put it in the cups for ease of use when she just wants to dab some on like that. Well, you can dab some out of the bottle. Well, you too, could, yeah, that's true. I'm actually, this. I'm almost out of it. That's why it's in this cup. Oh, okay. Yeah, I use it a lot, that's for sure. I have to get some more. I'm out of the golden honey too. Okay, now I'm gonna go around it with just a little bit of this hot orchid. Okay. Oh. Kathy does have four shops that you can uh, peruse. She has her Amazon shop, which has all the supplies you may need for paint pouring in there. She has her Etsy shop, which has all her original art in there. We've been adding pieces to that consistently. So there's some new pieces out there. She has her red bubble shop, which has her images imprinted on a wide variety of merchandise. That's a real cool site. And her legalist fine clothing shop. Now, guess what people? I got to put my Chantilly lace in the middle. Here we go. Can't go My diamond that. girl, That's diamond sure. girl. <laughs> You sure do shine. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> you know, I can, I can never not sing it, Phil. I know, I know. You know it. I just want to mention that there are links to all four of Kathy's shops in the description box. Okay. Now we're going to get our black cell activator out. We're going to get our hair dryer going. And we're going to blow this puppy. Again. The black cell activator is simply Amsterdam black paint and Australian Floetrol. Okay. Okay, where are you, baby? You ready, Phil? I'm ready. Okay, here we go. Hang on to your seat.
Oh, oh, oh. What happened? Oh, oh my no. Tilly lace is all over the floor. Oh, brother. Well, I got to get that up. Okay. All Find right. The wood. Things happen. I think the cord to her blower caught the cup and pushed it out onto the floor, but. Back in business. Over here, make sure you don't step in it. Hey, we're gonna have a glitzy floor now. Yeah. The Chantilly lace has lots of glitz and sparkle to it, so. Great. <laughs> Just what I wanted for my wood floor. <laughs> oh. I couldn't fall, you know, on the painting tarp. Of course not. Yeah, right. Of course, Kathy's blowing on the black cell activator, which brings up some of the colors from the central bloom. I can't believe that cord did that. Do do cord. Okay. Yeah, blow some of this out now. Oh, you got some wonderful colors all around the edge, that's for sure. And that's what the radio bloom is supposed to do by putting those dollops of color around the central bloom. As you can see, you pick up the blues and the greens and the reds, uh, all the different colors that were put around that central bloom, get out to the edge of the bloom very vibrantly. That'll teach me for setting that right there. Any hey, worse things have happened? Yeah, if you drop my phone into this, that would be <laughs> it. <laughs> well, one time after you cleaned your pool, uh, you didn't realize that it was, uh, the stuff you had taken out was leaking and that got all over the place. That was really yeah, that, yeah, bad. Yeah, then one of us stepped in it, probably me, and dragged it all over the house. That was that was a disaster. Had to get a scrubby, Bubby, to get it up. Ooh, this is pretty. Yeah, you got wonderful vibrant coloration around the bloom. It's a really nice shaped bloom. Although I know you're not done with it yet. I think it's even now. I mean, look at look at the wonderful colors around the edge all those beautiful pigments and prism pores that you put on there and I don't yes. ever go into the middle and can I uh, have some unsolicited advice yes I also like when you bring out uh, into the into the black a little bit. Oh, the color? Yeah. Well, yeah. Some of the uh, wrecking line. You don't have to do that. Out. But I, I do kind of like how you... Um, I'll do it with the wider. Yeah, it just gives a more... You don't have such a stark uh, edge around the bloom then. Oh, before uh, we end this video, I want to show the two. Uh, um, oh, the two metal? New metal that we just got back. Okay. They're beautiful people. Kathy had two of her images imprinted on metal 
aluminum actually, and they're they're, they're gorgeous. They're metal. And I they're well we'll show them. You'll show them. Oh, you have to go downstairs to get that. Just one of them. <laughs> okay. I mean, now I have to uh, entertain while you're gone, huh? Well, it's not hard for you to do. I'm not, I'm not a, a song and dance man. Start singing. Well, I guess I'm, maybe I'm a dog and pony man. <laughs> Jeez. Pony Maloney. Yep. I keep seeing that paint on my chest there. Okay, I think we got it now. Yes, it's just... I think it's we beautiful. got it, Bill. There's the central bloom. And then all those vibrant prison pour colors that Kathy put down. And then she topped them with uh, the different um, pigments and so forth. Here we go. Now slow, slow, slow. Okay, wow. Oh. Yeah, this is oh, oh man, absolutely gorgeous. Alive. This is beautiful, people. Beautiful. What you want to maintain is a nice, well-rounded bloom, which okay. she did. Well, you do that and okay. tell them I'm going to go get. Oh, okay, all the right. Uh, so the object of the radio bloom is to get a nice bloom that is well-rounded in shape. All of the dollops of color, very vibrant around the central the central bloom color. And then the black base, you want just enough around there, the edge to set off uh, the bloom. And this one turned out fabulous. Once it's dried and resined, it's gonna be really, really bright, colorful. At this point, I've run out of things to say. Okay. Which is unusual for me. This is the first one, people. Okay. And these are 20 by 30s. Wow. This one. Oh, uh, I can't even. You're gonna have to set it up a little higher. Okay, I gotta, I gotta back up. Okay. This one, um, you can hang a lot of different ways. You can have it up and down. You can show them the back so they can see. Right. Yeah, you, you can, can have, have it this way this way okay there's you can the hang back it the long way you can any way you want to hang right. these it's not real heavy but it comes with no. a special hanger and it just uh is just very clear and vibrant it uh, really was faithful to the image this was taken from one of my love paintings that i did back home I have a series of love paintings. They are my abstract, and they're all, all of them say love in them. When we go to the art shows, we take a few of those with us. Um, some I will never part with because they're just my babies. Yes. But this is taken from one of the loves. You did these for years before you got into the poor painting and so right. forth. You've got to turn it uh, the top back. There we go. Oh, back? Uh, yeah, like that. And again, what was the size of this again? 20 by 30. 20 by 30. So I'm going to move these because I don't want to get paint on them. Uh, those will be in the Etsy shop. Yeah, you can load those today. But I wanted to show those. Absolutely. They're beautiful. So I'm back here, people. Ah, this is beautiful, 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 beautiful. I love this. Oh, it's yeah. so pretty. This is really pretty. It is. So, if you like this, give me a thumbs up. Um, please subscribe to our channel. We'd love to have you join our family. Head on over to our Facebook group, Paint Pouring by Kathleen Miller. Hop on the train over there as well. There's a lot of great people in there. You can ask questions. You can post your creations. And um, both of them are free. It does not cost you to subscribe to my channel. It does not cost you anything to get into our group. So until the next time, everybody, stay healthy, stay well. And remember, it's only paint. And I will see you all later, alligators. Bye.